Okay, so as we read to the concept or the definition of the first type of relation, which is the the uh, one to one relation. So, uh, a relation A to B said to be a uh, one to one relation if no two elements of A have the same image and B or X and the same image and Y. So, for instance, um, we have illustrated an example. An example tayo, tatalan nito. So, yung A, um, uh, X, then yung B as Y. Okay, so, for instance, this one, this example is illustrated by example. Uh, in short, the concept of that is, um, kailangan walang repeating uh, elements dito sa A uh, corresponding to a codomain or so Y. Okay? So, for instance, ang A ngayon is, um, ang A is 1, then B, 2, then C, 4, then D is 3. Okay? So, <coughs> so, katulad nyan. Okay? So, always, uh, walang repeating um, elements dito corresponding to Y. Okay, so, in short, dapat isa isang partner. So, gaya ng one-to-one -one relation. So, as we, as we observe talagang one-to-one. -one. So, we have A, 1, B, 2, then C, 4, then D, 3. Okay? So, for instance, kung sa tao pa, so, in real uh, example, kung sa tao, for instance, meron tayong ganito. Okay, so, yan. So, kanyari, okay. So, ngayon, kung sa tao pa, um, Ana, si Ana ay kay Onda, kanyan, then si Rhea, kay Ken, si Bena, kay Kaloy, then si Rish, kay Ron. So, that's one-to-one -one relation. Diba? So, si Ana, kay Onda, so meron ng Ana, Konda. Then, we have the Rhea, kay Ken, then si Bena, Kaloy, then si Rish, Ron. So, yan ang concept ng one-to-one um, -one relation. So, walang repeating elements dito sa uh, X or dito sa A or dito sa domain corresponding to the codomain or the range sa Y. Okay? So, that's it. So, order type pa. So, mangyari magiging A, 1, then B, 2, then uh, C, 3, then D or okay so ganyan kung sa ordered pair pa okay kasi always domain and range ang x is yung domain natin okay ang x ngayon yung domain natin ang y natin is codomain or the what we call the range is the second type of relation which is the one-to-many relation. So, as we read to the concept or the definition of the one-to-many relation that A to B said to be one-to-many relation if an element of um, A or the X um, is related to two or more elements of um, B or the Y. Okay, so, for instance, dito naman is, uh, one, uh, one to many relation is, uh, A is um, 1, then meron mo tayong A is 2, then B is 3, then meron tayong um, C is uh, B is 3, then B is 4, then we have um, C is 5, then C is 4, so again, so as we observe, that's one to many relation. So, if you write it into Cartesian product or the ordered pair, so you can write it. So, we have A1, then A2. So, yan, B3, then B3. So, always doon na katutok ang R. Okay, that's the um, one to many relate. Okay, so, kung babalikan natin yung example, kanina, itong si Ana. So, kung dito pa si Ana, kay Konda, then kay Ken pa. Then si Rhea, kay Ken, then kay Kanoy pa. Okay, then si Bena, kay Kaloy, then kay Ran pa. Then kay Rish, si Ran, then kay Kaloy pa. So, that's uh, one to uh, many relation.
きさあ illustrative example of the many to one relation that's the inverse of one to many relation so in many to one relation oh, nabasa natin dun sa concept nya that's um, a to b okay a to b said to be uh, many to one relation if two or more elements of a um, are related to an element of b okay so that's one so we have uh, ion one then a two a three b then four b so many to one relation so okay say sandito dimension dalawa dot that's many to one but then isa dito meron siyang dalawa so to write it in the um addition product you can write it that a1 um no 1a so for instance um okay, so let's not into condition product we have 1a uh, 2a then 3b and 4b that's that's the condition product of the ordered pair <clears throat> the last part of or the, the last type of relation is many to many relation so nabasa naman natin as we read that in many to many relation um, a to uh, a y or a to b or x y or a to b is said to be many to many relation if two or more elements of A or X uh, are related to two or more elements of uh, A to Y or X, Y. Okay. So, ito naman is pang maramihan na ito kasi many to many relations. So, we have A1, A2, then A3. Then, we have B4, B2, C5, C4, um, C3, uh, D3, then D5, then D4. Then E naman, E2, then E5, then E4. So, ganyan. So, many to many relation. So, mahaba siya pag, uh, if you write it on so, the mahaba siya. Okay, so, it's the con kung balikan natin yung kanina, we have yung sa tao pa. Um, example, this one. So, Anna... Kay Ken, kay Konda, so Anna Ken, Anna Konda, and then Anna Kalay, then Raya, Ken, then Konda, then Sabena, Ran, Kalay, then, then Konda, then Rish, uh, Ran, Kalay, then Ken. Okay, that, that's many to many relation.